Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dr. Jordan here. And today's gonna be a good one, especially for myself. It is to eliminate hurry in your life, slow things down, concentrate on a single step. And oftentimes we will get um, in a rush, in a hurry. We will try to multitask. We will try to get a ton of things done and a lot of times what will happen is when we're trying to get all those things done we'll actually reduce the quality of what we're doing and even the effectiveness of what we're doing because we're trying to get too much done we're too much of a hurry we're too busy we can't do the things that we really want to do the things that will be uh give us the most improvement in our lives because we're too busy doing the busyness of life and so what we really need to do is we need to step back. We need to take that step back and go, okay, what is it that is going to really, what they call, move the needle forward? What is going to get us the best bang for our buck? What is it that is going to help us get the life that we want? And then we need to learn to reduce the hurry around everything else. And, you know, it could be hard. Um, I understand. I got a lot going on. But I think think it's more about being present in the moment um, there's a book out there that talks about elim eliminating hurry and in it it talks a lot about uh, the life of Jesus and how you know Jesus was never really in a hurry he would be teaching somebody would come up to him a good friend would come up and say hey one of your friends is dying you know, he's really sick. He's not going to make it. And Jesus continues to teach. He stays where he is for another couple of days and then says, okay, let's go see them. You know, there's a guy that his daughter is really sick. And so Jesus says, sure, we'll go and see her. But on the way, he stops and talks to people and he preaches. And, you know, there's got to be some sort of frustration in those people because it doesn't really seem like he's in a hurry but he knows his place he knows what he's doing and he doesn't need to hurry and so we need to act more like that like okay there could be a ton of things going on but being present in the moment focusing on the thing that is the most important at that moment not hurrying off to the next thing not trying to multitask multitasking is false there's no such thing as multitasking you try to multitask, it causes problems, and it's not really a good thing. People that brag that they're a good multitasker, that just means that their brain is scattered. Um, but making sure that we are really eliminating the busyness, because a lot of times the busyness comes down to, you know, scrolling Facebook, watching TV. You know, there's stats out there that say that people spend 2,200 hours a year on watching TV. That's a lot of hours. You get a lot of stuff done. People are spending, you know, 700 to 1,000 hours on social media. You can get a lot of stuff done if you reduce those countless hours of just mindless scrolling. So we can get rid of some of those things, and which will then allow us to reduce the hurry, allow us to focus on the things that are most important, and really be able to give out the best quality in our lives for us and for those that we love. So if you need any help, let me know. I'm here for you. You got this. Dr. Jordan here. Have a great day.